to Kofi, really close, and then uh, SBT, plus the Spaceys. But we're going to get right on into this final set of this commentary block with uh, Dill and Venom. I haven't seen Venom play this Joker too much. I'm super excited to see what he's going to do differently compared to other Jokers, or if he's just going to, you know, take it the standard Joker way. I like his approaches with Gun. Yep. Yeah, it, it, I mean, you saw earlier Venom was trying to Rebels guard that uh, that gyro, and it wasn't really working, but then he uses the gun, and it actually shoots the gyro away. And it looks like if he has these options to mess with Dill's gyro, that'll be really good in controlling the pace in his sense. And we already have our Sen basically out now. Our yeah, Sen's so scary. I mean, we were talking about gun in the beginning stages of the match, but Dill is basically just... Faded back and then done a forward air every single time Venom wants to go for that approaching gun. No fear wow. from Dill right now. Honestly, I love it. Um, even with our sun out, he was just like, all right, cool. Uh, you're still in a really bad position, and I'm just going to back air you for it. Or yeah. forward smash you Dill for says, it. Arsene, who? Laser neutral. And oh, there you go. Here comes Venom using the Rebels guard. You know what? Like, all right, like, <laughs> let's, let's get Arsene back on, back on track here. Yeah, I, don't Dill, I love anymore. his conversions. Look at this. Forward air, forward air, dash attack, forward air. Not going to get any other combos off of it, but still a four hit combo from a character that's as big as Rob. That's what you want to see. All right, Venom's sharking an aerial to take him out. That almost killed him. I like how I like how he's mixing recovering high and recovering low. But Arsene already gone, and Dill, Dill actually did a really good job of just avoiding getting hit. Yeah, the F for smash sure. again. Dill has been doing a good job in general, as you're saying, of weaving outside of uh, Joker's hitboxes. In general, Joker is a great character, but wow, did you see he just packaged that gyro up yeah, and he sent just, it to him. Yeah, but he caught it. That was that's the most important that's the most important thing. The backer's not even gonna wow. take it off stage. I really I really just love Dill's movement. Like you can hate Rob all you want, but Dill, the way that he's weaving in and out, making sure that he's not getting uh, clipped by too many of these Joker aerials is really smart. I mean, he got clipped there, but you can see he's mixing up a recovery, going high, going low. Venom, though, going to fire right back. Ooh, gets the grappling hook. Goes for yeah. the second up air. Doesn't quite get it there. And Venom's bringing it back. Dill hasn't really been able to put on much percent since he lost that first stock, and really even in general. Um, Venom finally finding these gun confirms that he was looking for uh, earlier. Gets Ooh, the grappling the hook and brings himself back on stage. What's he going to do here? Down throw setting up for a tech chase on the platform. Not going to get anything. Instead, Venom pushing Dill off stage. Goes Ooh, deep. Fast not going to get that back He fast falls down there. I think he was expecting a uh, he was expecting a backer off of it. But, like, right there. But not going to take that stock yet, Rob. Heavy. Yeah, Venom hasn't really been able to get these confirms off stage just yet. The one back air he got didn't kill at like 140%. But there you go, getting that back air and a late kill puts Venom in the lead. Right, and I mean, we've been singing Dill's praises this entire time, but a character like Joker, down throw. Ooh, an Arsene. <laughs> we got some a avid Arsene fans in the crowd. The crowd, you can, I don't know if you can hear them, but they're just screaming Arsene. <laughs> Actually, I think that's an outro. Is that? Enough. Um, Dill doing a good, <laughs> Dill doing a good job of just making, getting that meter low. Really? Ooh. I'm surprised no up throw, but Dill, I guess it doesn't no, really that's, matter. That's pretty much a if you get, if you read like what they're gonna do when you ground them like that, it's pretty much a confirmed death. Ooh, but you know what's also a confirmed this combo. Forward air from Dill is going to set up for a little Ooh, stage. Goes to the back air. I like that, Dill. Venom's sharking for that back air, but gonna bait with the gun again. You know, if you're watching at home and it looks like Venom is just doing those double jump gun approaches, and you might be wondering, well, dude, I'm not in the top 64, but I could hit him with that. It's the way that he's mixing it up. He's right. not always going for that gun. So you go for the back air there, and even though it looks like the same option, it's not. And Venom's getting that back air. Canada on the board again. Venom, really smart use of our send there. I mean, the match was close the entire time, but just he wasn't fishing too much for his aerials. I thought, like, a lot of the times we see players just kind of, like, jumping back air in place, but he was actually kind of following Dill around. Like, Dill did a really good job of avoiding him, but Venom was just kind of, like, chasing him. Like, all right, like, you're going to go here. Let me throw out a back air here. And that's what it was. 
the bands. Oh, the triplots. Interesting. Yeah. Um, Battlefield and Yoshi's Story. So Dill, looking at his options right now. I don't really know how strong of a band choice that is. I don't really know exactly where Joker wants to go versus where Rob wants to go. And we're just going to go right back to Kalos. A little surprised, honestly. I would expect Venom to not mind the triplats, but you never know. Right. Game two going in, Venom checking his phone, probably putting on his music. Yeah, you got to get the tunes going. I can't play with music. No? It confuses me. I don't know. I think I, I need to hear. I think with certain characters, you don't necessarily need to hear, but like sometimes you just need to hear. We're going to start back on Kalos. This might be the first game that we see Kalos um, played more than just once a set. Yeah, that's true. It's I, I think Kalos is one of those stages that has kind of grown on people as time goes on. Oh, wow, that little footstool is kind of interesting. Um, I was almost expecting to see like footstool in a gyro lock on the ground, but Venom gets out of it without taking very Ooh, much percent Ooh, okay, at all. clips him with the grappling hook. Not sure if he wanted to bring him down, but I'm sure he'll just take the extra damage. Mm -hmm. And once again, going for that landing gun. Such you know what I've noticed is that option. Venom is using gun to get around gyro. Yeah. Not necessarily just to like get percent in. Um, but he's using it to like, he's jumping over gyro and then using it some sort of aerial option. And I like that. Ooh, tries to go more grappling hut again, but gets him there. Still saying no, but here we go. Our sun out. One of the first options that happened. Oh, wow. No, you hate to see that. I hate to. I still hate to see head. players SD. Oh yeah, for sure. You want to see a good clean set. Dill clearly upset about that SD. Yeah. It's a forward like smash. Like you pointed out, Dill. Not, not giving up just yet. I mean, Arsene is off the table now. Ooh, oh, but catches yeah. him. That was an awesome read. He saw it. Uh, Venom was a little bit antsy to get out of his shield there on top of that platform. Knew he was going to jump and instead just Ooh. goes for that awesome oh. side B. Okay, Dill. I love Dill's combos. They're so cool. Venom was waiting for that gyro to drop on top of his, Venom, uh, his uh, rebel guard. I called him a Venom guard. But the instead guard. gets hit by the laser. Drops uh, Rebel Guard and then gets hit by the Gyro after. So smart stuff by Dill, knowing that if he can hit him twice, he might just get Venom to stop dropping it. Oh, and that's the first time we've actually seen Venom use Tetracarn. Mm -hmm. uh, ooh, Dill. Dill? Oh. Oh, no. <laughs> oh! oh! The whole crowd walking with me. Devin over on stream setup, clapping for his crewmate. Oh, yeah, confirming that down air. But we're seeing now... Dill come alive right now. Yeah, Dill actually was looking a little bit out of it in the beginning seconds of the match. Um, but taking that really good, quick stock off of a nice combo. Ooh, and now I love that into it. air. All right, Venom. I Ven see you. It's not completely all lost. I see you. Ooh, that was the first time that we've seen Venom just roll on stage instead of just jumping and gunning. Yeah. like it. I like the mix-ups. Ooh, goes for the F-Smash read. And that was the that first might have killed. First F-Smash Venom. But that wow. <laughs> My God. First F Smash Venom had gone for in Arsene, which is one of those options, again, that these Jokers like to use a lot. Um, maybe it's just not his style, but he's definitely been doing pretty well without it. Rolling around the, the gyro this time. Venom's doing a really like I said, awesome Venom, job yes, getting this, away from those the gyros. Gun is, the gun is more, it's like half of an approach, half of an escape, and I really love it. Yeah. Venom's going to have Arsene on the board very soon using the gun. Dill's got to be careful. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, oh my god, the gyro. I can't tell if the gyro helped or if the gyro hurt him yeah, there. Honestly, there's no real uh, no real clue. Now Venom has Arsene. It's winding down, but Dill still has to watch out. A few more hits will even this game up real quick. Dash attack. Oh, this is scary. Oh my god, Dill. Dill is hanging out to the side blast zone like he doesn't care. And, and he that doesn't. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. I don't have the I don't have the nerves for that. And we got the years out for Dill. I love it. I love it. I love Tri-State, man. I think Tri-State's like just as loud as Florida. You ever? Oh, I, I've never been to Florida. I went to Florida for like CEO, like God knows how long ago, and like they were loud. And yeah. then like Tri-State's pretty loud. I love loud regions that support their support their uh, support, support their support players. The boys. Yeah. I wanna I wanna start getting out to more like further out of state tournaments. The furthest I've ever been is Shine, but. Shine's a good tournament though. It's, I love it. 
Awesome tournament. Shine's a really good tournament. This is my first time at Defend the North, and I'm Same. loving this it. This is one of my favorite tournaments, if not my favorite tournament ever. Really? Wow. And I've been here literally, literally for two and a half hours. Just commentating. Yeah. <laughs> I, I got here, played three melee friendlies, and then commentated. So that should tell you how beautiful it is and how nice everybody is so far. Right. I mean, it's Tri-State, man. Tri-State's I love coming home. down to Tri-State. Feels like home. Great. Anyway, I'm going to stop gushing about my own region. We're going to go to town and city for game three. I'm interested to see what Venom's going to do to mix it up here. Um, approaching with gun right over the top. I feel like, a, I think Dill has caught on to it though. Now he's going to do it again. Yeah. it's what's What makes gun so good in the Ooh. air is, wow, okay, Dill with these little combos. Ooh, God. What makes gun so good in the air is just Joker's incredible aerial drifts and options that he has out of it. He can weave back, he can weave in, he can air dodge, and you see Venom using all of them. But instead, Dill catching his landings with those down tilts and getting some nice combos. Nice, I love the weight by Dill there. I feel like a lot of the times people need to not just go to the ledge, but like give in a recovery. Oh, goes for the grappling hook too. Arsene out on the table right now. Ooh, nice up, to, up air, saying kind of get off me. But the retreat to the platform, interesting. I mean, you know how strong Arsene back air is. I would have been a little bit nervous going over there. And you know Venom searching for it. Yeah, I'm telling you, Dill's not afraid to hang outside there near the blast zone. Ooh, nice. I, wow! Oh my god, okay, beautiful conversion. Not gonna kill yet, but that was a great call out. That was an amazing reach there. And he's gonna get that kill right there. Dill, beautiful conversions off this Rob. If you do not know Dill, I don't believe Dill travels very, very far out of state, but he, I believe he's one of the best Robs. Look at this. Oh, yeah, for sure. Every time there's a tournament in New England, you'll see at least one name, Dill, on the upset thread. Oh, for sure. Venom approaching with his gun still. Here we go. Arsene out, though. The Nair into the fair. Goes for the second one. I really just love no fear with Arsene, just zero fear. He's like, you know what, it's Joker. And I mean, the more you hit Joker while he has Arsene, the faster it goes away. But still, finally looking for that back air, Venom gets it. Venom not gonna have Arsene for this stock. Oh, nice gyro throw up. Oh, God. If that had hit though. Oh! Ah, and he gets the down air. That the whole down crowd, so I watched solid. the whole entire crowd. Everyone made the same exact face. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone was like, oh, <laughs> like you, hate to, you hate to see it. Venom on the ledge here, trying to figure out the best approach to this edge guard. Ooh, okay, takes a little bit of the top for the Rebels guard. But at what cost? He's oh gonna take 47% on that last talk and climbing. Venom just trying to find these back airs. It seems like he's having a lot of uh, He's having a lot more success getting the back airs as the kill as anything else rather than like either an up smash read or anything like that. So he's just gonna try and keep Dill off. Ooh. Yeah. And Dill's not afraid to go high. He's not afraid to go drift outside. Ooh, but the F smash. Not gonna take it quite yet. Next one definitely will, but Arsene. Ooh, nice back air. Go I feel like Venom's gotta start playing this a little bit more aggressively. But Dill taking a sweet time off the ledge. I really like the air dodge to it. Yeah, and Dill, he's not afraid to use all of his fuel to get back to stage. Ooh, there Such we an go. interesting kind of strategy. A lot of Robs are afraid of running out of fuel and getting stuck with no options, but Dill sometimes seems to always have gas in the tank. Venom catches the catches the gyro and is like, yeah, I don't want this. Bring it back. Ooh, okay. I like the down tilt to I like the down tilt to um, bring it in. Goes for the uh oh. Ooh, catches the reeve and the jump, and that's gonna be game. Two or game two for Dill, and we got the yours out. If you cannot hear, if you can not hear them, uh, trust me, it's a it's a sight. Oh yeah, for sure. Philly's Philly's starting to talk. Philly, New York City are starting to do their do their thing, speak their truth. Dill definitely has been pulling it together. Rob has a lot of like weirdly fast options, especially with down tilt and forward air. And Dill's doing a really good job of every time Venom wants to do something, just kind of smacking him away, going for the down tilt, and going for the And it's not necessarily border. like smacking away sometimes. It might, it could be the smack away. It could also be Dill just waiting. Yeah. Uh, a lot of the times Dill's recovery, he's not recovering the same way every time. Sometimes he's going super high. Oh yeah. Sometimes he's just going to the ledge. I think part of that is the reason why Dill's doing so well. Um, 
Venom isn't doing too terribly, though. Uh, we're going to go to FD. Oh, wait. Oh, I, I know this. Yes. <laughs> what are we listening to? Um, I don't know, but I know Dill loves um, the music on this stage. And I, I also do, as a giant Legend of Zelda fan. Venom, either picking his music or hovering. I would, ooh, the ditto? The ditto? Was it? It wasn't. No, I was thinking um, uh, of uh, a different Canadian player of, I believe, some relation, uh, Holy, who is Ally's uh, brother, right? Yep. Yes. Who was one of the best Robs that didn't fresh. travel. He really? was the number one Rob in Brawl that. that we were getting from that from Devin. Huh. Wow. Right. And he was a pretty prominent in Smash 4 until he dropped off. Um, so maybe, you know, Venom might have some Experience. Some knowledge, yeah, with the Rob, but... Having a little quick conversation. Then I'm going to change the tune. It's always in the tunes, right? It's in the color, it's in the tune. Oh, yeah. Yes! Oh, come on, I want to see the Ken, please. Yes, <laughs> I, I, I need some Ken. Go with Cloud, okay? Come on, Ken. Ken, 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 please. Ken, Ken. Come on, go Ken. Ken. No, go back. Ken is so cool. Ken. Ken. I, Kingman was just like, oh, Ken. I'm like, what do you mean, oh, Ken? Ken's sick. Ken is awesome. Ken. Yes. Ken. Yes. yes. All right, cool. All right. All right Crowd's we're behind see some him. Ken, baby. I'm super excited for this one. Okay, here we go. If you have not seen Ken since the patch, oh, it's going to be interesting. Oh yeah. oh, yeah, the cast theme. Oh, this is like, this is such a banger. I'm this not is a really good song. The stage is also beautiful. Dill, I think is Dill's gonna be a little bit more um, careful with his with his um, approaches. But Ken does a lot of damage just based off of two moves. Yeah, and we're gonna see definitely a different style of play here from Venom. Um, instead of what he was doing with Joker, where he was kind of trying to get in with that gun and, and look around, instead Venom's gonna be trying to like put moves in Dill's face and basically just ask Dill like, "What can you do about it?" Right. I mean, it seems just like oh, now wow. that Venom is just kind of snuffing Dill with anything that anything that is in Ken's arsenal. And this is why I love Ken. Dill just trying to find a way to come in now, getting the Nair into the into the forward air. You can see Venom right here spacing in, not going to get that Nair. I like... Um, just like in general, um, I like the use of the stall just to see where the where the ah. opponent's gonna go. And Venom gonna sure you can his way up into this game. The down throw into the up tilt. Oh my Ooh, god, damn! Re -grab. That was amazing. Up tilt, up air. He did that twice. It didn't kill quite yet, but I love the attempt. That if <laughs> if if Venom wasn't shook by that, like I don't know. It was just the read, the nair just clipping Dill right off. Again. Yeah, nerves of steel there from Venom as he composed himself. 161%. Dill's gonna be looking to kill here soon with the grab. You know what you know what uh, Venom is looking for. Ooh, okay. Nice spot dodge. Ooh. Dill's like get off me. And Dill is just struggling to find a kill option. Not even just like either like a throw, but he's just struggling to get something. Yeah. And you see Venom is very literally just running up, shielding the gyro and making Dill pull another one. Every time there's a gyro out on stage, Venom mitigates it as soon as he possibly can. A little early, Venom sitting at 214. Dill struggling to get in. Venom. And you know what rage means. Yeah, exactly, 220, I mean, I'm scared. Oh, that's gotta be it. Yep. Yeah, this up throw is definitely it. All the right. Tombstone pile driver. Tri-State cheering on Dill. Ooh, I like just to jump on the stage. Oh, God. He meets him in the air with the gyro. Doesn't get anything quite off of it, though. Ooh, that little axe kick there, covering um, the, the tricky recovery there from Dill. Venom just needs to find this kill, and he'll be in oh, a good place. Oh, no, the spot dodge. All right, going to the you other side of the stage. stage. Oh, I like that. He didn't even go for ledge. He was just like, you know what? Surprise, I'm here with the off air. <laughs> Wish he's in front of me. So excited to see the Ken combo. Dash into down tilt, gonna get a little confirmed there. 24.8 on Dill now. He's gonna have to start putting stuff together if he wants to win this match. It just seems like Venom is just clipping him with Nair and then just getting these explosive combos. 
And then Dill is just struggling to, like, get any type of setup, either with Gyro or just in general. Mm -hmm. And there you see the one time Venom doesn't get rid of this Gyro, it messes up his Tatsu. Obviously, there's a reason to do it. Axe Kick not going to break shield, instead going to shield poke. Now Dill is off stage. What's he going to do to get back on? Dill waiting on edge. Venom knows he's in the lead here. Oh, misses oh. the Shoryuken. Down throw, forward air, going to uh, focus through it. Ooh, okay, I like the air dodge, but I also love the wait by Dill. I'm not sure if this is gonna kill, and it will. Wow. Dill, I'm sure Dill wants to end this set here. I guarantee you he does not want to go in another game with this Ken. But 98, and we know that Ken kills early now. Oh my god! He knew. He was just running. Oh. He's fishing for it. All these down tilts. Yep. The crowd kind of, kind of, kind of scared here. Cast theme playing in the background. Venom looking for that kill. Dill's at 112. It's getting to that oh point where God, Venom can kill Oh my God! He's just the running. The oh, he gets get the top not gonna end, take not gonna it kill. quite yet. Venom looking for it. Venom looking for it. Oh, back throw. Just getting over with the Tatsu again. Oh air dodge God. in. Dill. Dill. There, forward air, forward air. Gonna top not the gonna sour spot. You out of it. Back air not gonna connect. What's he gonna do? Axe kick. Not gonna break shield. Oh my God, that was terrifying. This Nair onto stage. Oh my God. Air dodge down. But that Back kick air is definitely gonna, gonna take it. And we are going to another <laughs> hype game five. Venom bringing the excitement with that ten. Told you. Hangman, where you at? That's all I'm gonna say. I'm so excited for this. Oh, this is the last set of our commentary vlog, and this is the last game. Oh my god. It's this gonna is be so exciting. Sick. So sick. <laughs> Before we get into it, it's been a pleasure. It has been a pleasure, Rhythm. <sighs> I'm so happy. I love this Ultimate. Is Ultimate's so Ultimate's cool. Ultimate's so fun. <laughs> Ultimate's so much fun. I'm so glad to be back to the scene. Watching some hype matches. I've played like every single Smash game like competitively for like X amount of time, and no game will ever be as fun to me as Ultimate is. Really? Maybe it's because I play Zelda. I don't know. That's true. And Zelda's you finally yeah. good. Zelda's getting her. <laughs> she's she's getting there. I'm pushing her. You're pushing the map. I'm pushing her. I'm Literally trying to push Zelda. There's tons of good Zeldas, but All it's right. not about me. It's not about Zelda. It's about Dill and Venom. So Venom Rob and once Ken. Once again, um, ban triplats. I don't know if we can see it there. No, we. Uh, yes, we can. Yeah. House of 3K with the beautiful overlays. Um, and we're going to see where uh, Dill wants to take it here for this final game of this final set of top 64 first round. Um, oh, my God. I'm so excited. We're going to fill out this winner's round two bracket with this final set. Don't tell me Dill's changing. I don't know. I mean, I don't know which other characters Dill even has. I've only known him for the Is Rob. Venom going back Joker? No. After I that, I'd be shocked. I think Venom picks first, right? Because winner stays. Winner decides character first. I would be shocked if he went back to Joker. If he goes back to Joker, I don't know how I feel, but we got, we got crowd requests going on let's right now. Let's be honest. Now. I think it's because both of us just want to see more Ken. I mean, yeah. But the... Can we just talk about the ending of that last match? I felt like so many things were whiffing. Yeah. Like, Venom would just walk up to him and do nothing. Like, that's what made it so scary. And we're on Town and City, game five. Here we go. Try to stay getting loud. All right. Still sticking with the Rob. Last game of round one, top 64 winners. Who's going to move on in the winner's bracket? Ooh, Who's going to have to go. fight through? Dill starting with a 51% combo. Are you kidding me? Oh, my God. And snuffs the approach with the Tatsu. But Venom gonna get that near in. I love the hit. I love the the shield noises. I don't know why. Oh yeah, for sure. Dill had a really strong start here, but Venom fired right back very quickly. Dill waiting though. I love how Dill waits. Goes for the backer there, but gotta be smart. There's Those hitboxes by yeah, the hitboxes by Ken are actually pretty good. Ooh, reads him, and wow, that's gonna be it for that the one stop. In the up tilt for uh, sure you can. I can't even talk right now. Ooh, the arm's off stage, though, and that's going to take him right back. We're in for an amazing game five, everybody. Oh, yeah. Zero percent to zero percent on the second stock. The, the percents are even. The stocks are even. All that is left is to see who can get those first hits. Tatsu not going to get a follow-up after. But Dill 
still in the lead in most of these stocks. Ooh. Wow, that was a great landing with that Tatsu. A, yeah, but that also, just the up air kick, I feel like really threw him off the off of it a little bit. Up throw. Kind of me. I love how Dill is just meeting Venom in the air with any type of option. Ooh, I love. Oh my god. The way that Venom just runs in and then just starts doing his thing. Ooh, okay. Waited too waited too long on the ledge. Tries to get in loud. It looks like Venom is thrown Ooh, for a loop a little bit. The oh, but Dill getting back on stage, somehow avoiding the Shoryuken. I, I he got clipped by it, but it. I don't think it was I don't think it was enough to kill him. Ooh. He got hit by like a weird hitbox. I don't really know. Oh, down tilt, <laughs> up crowd, B, and the that's gonna be screams. it. Screams every time, like every single time <laughs> that Venom approaches the shield, the crowd just starts screaming. There we go, Venom putting on the percent, 26 now. It's Ooh, Dill looking for that back air. Ooh, I like the spot dodge by Dill, but Ken's hitboxes. Ooh. Scary Dill situation. No Percents are going up. Oh, wow! God, that's going to be it. What and a combo Venom. from Venom to end this game five. Venom not even go for going for the flaming Shoryuken. Instead, confirming off of his, uh, I think that was forward air, getting that Shoryu so high in the blast zone. A, a reminiscent almost of that combo uh, from Locus on Tweak to first cement himself as a top Ryu. Now Venom, another Canadian using those Street Fighter characters instead with Ken. Forward air, sure you, you all the way up in the top. And that is it. Venom, another Canadian moving on in this bracket. And I believe that is the end.